Basically, it started as a PhD research and a way to respond to the post-socialist urban transformation of former Yugoslavia. However, it was done in a completely different and rather unconventional way because I visited dozens and dozens and dozens of apartments of personal private spaces of people in three different former Yugoslav cities, Banja Luka, Nish and Podgorica. And basically it is a tale of the everyday life of homeowners who are suddenly provided with this fantastic freedom to deviate from the norm by modifying their apartments. So it is, it is a micro scale research of not only post-socialist transformation but what happened happens with the Yugoslav mass modern housing and architectural legacy in that sense. So I'm also painting landscapes of this new architecture, the new uh, social reality, which is characterized by a lot of anarchy, the new ethics and morals. And yeah, sometimes I also act as a marriage counselor. <laughs> so it is a very fragile and emotional story, a set of very intimate narratives and family portraits. And basically, it, everything is seen through the eyes of, of privatized apartments. And it also embodies the idea that it, it defends housing as a home. So home is no longer uh, an architectural design. It is a story of a life being lived. And um, maybe our cities are a bit ugly due to this epidemic of glazed balconies and self-appropriated former common spaces. But I believe there is a much beauty to it because we are free to express who we are. So that's who I am and that's what my work is all about.